Hello everybody, welcome to another gaming news. Uh, yesterday I didn't make an episode, I didn't have time, I had a busy day yesterday. Uh, but uh, anyway, today we are going to talk about uh, uh, Hogwarts Legacy, the reviews are up. Uh, for all intents and purposes the game is very good, not perfect, but very good. With supposedly it's <clears throat> all uh, kind of what we all wanted in a wizarding world kind of thing with magic. Uh, and how we're going about i will leave here the extra life um uh, review here um uh, the guy just had around like 30 hours plus give or take uh, and but it's uh, basically in, in tandem with uh, all the reviews that i saw um and it's very very good surprisingly good from what we can see um and uh, it's good the only thing that i um have to make a remark here is like they supposedly have like an online store i don't know uh, the, the online store was not up when they did the review for any of the reviews so uh i'm not sure how it's going to work if it's going to have like some balancing stuff for you to get to the store or not um uh, just wait and see for uh when it is up because the game is not launched i think it's like one or two days still uh for the official launch uh but yeah uh so far so good uh let's hope that it continues like that um now there is on steam like the next fest or something like that and it's starting popping up a lot of uh, game demos and and more st info for gaming that are launching this year mainly uh indie studios and i covered a little bit i think this this one uh the last case of benedict fox um it's like um metroidvania style stuff but uh, with some uh, detective elements here and there it's 2d side scrolling and it seems very interesting uh, how we're going about it uh, i think do we have like this new uh, gameplay uh, video here uh, i think i the last time i spoke we only had like one trailer and it seems very interesting because the even the the, the combat itself seems a little bit so uh, so uh, dark soulsly sorry about that um but yeah uh, it seems very interesting uh, um uh, how they're going about the game uh, we hope that it's it's supposedly going to launch april 27th let's hope uh, that everything goes well and these games that i'm going to talk about i will leave um a page uh, the link on the page uh, on steam so you can check out if it interests you or not um ravenbound i spoke this one it's like a road like uh with some Dark Souls aspects on the combat itself, but the mechanics of the role, like it was interesting me more. And it's, I think, based a lot of it on, I don't know, is it Swedish? I, say, I know it's Nordic, in the Northern countries, uh, um, folklore and, and mythology. Um, I'm not sure, I, I don't, don't want to screw this up. I think it's Slavic one. Uh, Slavic? Uh, uh, yeah, 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 sorry. Uh, I know. Uh, Scandinavian, sorry. Scandinavian folklore, not Slavic. Slavic, it's, it's the other way. Sorry. Um, another uh, with the monsters here seems seems pretty good. Um, <clears throat> uh, yeah, I will leave also the page here on uh, from Steam here. And lastly, we have uh, I, I don't know how I caught this one. Uh, Bleak Sword DX. I think this is like. Uh, Kind of remaster or an enhancement from the original game from where I, it's from devolved digital um it's like a kind of 2d game the way it's presented it's very interesting as you can see it's like a, a 2d squares here like i don't know if the, if it is like stages and you go about it uh, fighting this one i'm not sure if it is also road light um but um it, it seems pretty interesting the way they go about it uh it caught my eye i think I, i'm not mistaken already uh, which list is all of them that i'm talking here um but yeah sim it's a one that it caught my eye uh, mainly how the graphic and then those little boxes here that kind of levels i don't know how it's going to work uh but interested me um here on um epic game store we still have three games the dishonored one and this city of gangster is like a mafia style city builder city management thingy i think but here this is the one that caught my eye the dishonored death of the outsider uh till 9th of february at least in my time 8 p.m um 
I will also leave a link here. And System Shock also appeared here on the next fest. Um, the demo, there is a demo here if you want to play it and try it out. Um, it's the the remake of System Shock uh, 2, uh, basically. So um, uh, sorry, the remake of System Shock. Um, it seems pretty good. I never played the, the original one, unfortunately. Um, it supposedly will come out in March 2023 from this year on. Um, but yeah, basically this is it. Not much else here. A little bit slow here. Uh, the news mostly cover Hogwarts, some uh, GPU stuff, but uh, it's just people. Um, some laptops also from GT4090, $5,000. Uh, a lot of things that didn't got my attention because it's it's what it's expected. Uh, but I'll wrap up here uh, with my Go Get Fund Me for me to do more and better content for my private clients. And also after upgrading, I will continue to do this. Uh, daily gaming series, some scripted content with some deep dives, and of course continue my gameplay series that I uh, basically paused from like five to six years ago. And basically this is it guys. Hope you have a wonderful day. I will see you in the next one. Till then, Kunami Master out.